Daniel Bryan has been knocked down so many times, but he always manages to pop back up. Uh, his resiliency really is unbelievable, Cole. Truthfully, I'm good with any Survivor Series match that doesn't include four doinks. <laughs> what was that all about anyway? Wasn't one doink enough? This is gonna be something, King. Kane looks like he wants to make a statement here tonight. Yeah, and I'm just glad he's not coming down here for us, Cole. We've both been on the receiving end of a Kane beating, and I think I can speak for the both of us in saying it is not fun. And the enthusiasm from these St. Louis crowds never ceases to amaze me. Listen to this arena and the enthusiasm from these St. Louis crowds never ceases to amaze me. whispers backstage about whether or not this guy has what it takes to get the job done here tonight. Tornado tag is underway. Any strategy you would utilize in this type of match, King? Well, so many things are different about this type of match than a normal tag match. But one thing you don't want to do is leave your partner alone and get a two-on-one advantage. Another great crowd here in St. Louis. The fans here in this great city never disappoint. And so taking a look at Eric Rowan, 
Any thoughts come to mind? I'm not sure if I've ever experienced an eerie silence that falls over an entire arena like I do when Bray Wyatt announces he's here. Even in darkness, you can see the whites of people's eyes and the audience fixated on Bray Wyatt and frightened beyond explanation at what he's going to do. A ton of talent, a ton of ability, certainly someone to keep an eye on. Bray Wyatt spots the opening. Clearly on a mission here. and he fails to connect with anything that time. Man, that was some miss, all right. I could feel the breeze all the way over here. Kane showing some expert prowess here. You know, I've been in a lot of arenas, and I've seen a lot of things, but I've never seen a capacity crowd stand with such a combination of fear and awe as when Bray Wyatt begins his ominous walk to the ring. Look at this, Bray Wyatt doing some good work here. Eric Rowan showing some adversity right now. Well, we're on the move here. Eric Rowan with good timing here. Eric Rowan looking to capitalize. He's bringing it back inside the ring now. I can't blame him, keep it in the ring. Look how slow he is to recover here. That was some serious punishment. I think you can tell by looking into the disturbing eyes of Bray Wyatt that he likes this. This man enjoys knowing that when he walks into an arena, people are frightened of him more with each horrifying step he takes. If that doesn't tell you what you need to know about Bray Wyatt, then I don't know what would. Well, Michael, I think now people everywhere realize what Bray Wyatt... Camel clutch applied! And man, is he pulling back on that neck! Good job getting to the ropes there. He's doing everything he can to get his bearings back here. Otherwise, this match could be over sooner than anyone could have anticipated. Yeah, Cole, this is when you have to settle things down. Get the blood flowing back in your body and strategize what your next move or your next form of attack will be. How much damage did that do? A lot from the looks of it. Look at the attack here. Oh man, talk about a direct hit. The shoulders are down. You know, when you look at Bray Wyatt, he may- Brian's out. He's in big trouble. Look out for Kane. Cole, what's he got in mind? Oh, I think this man means business. The shoulders are down. Again. Man, oh man, did he take a wild swing with that one. You're right. That was wild indeed. Good thing we're over here. That suplex was picture perfect. What makes And into the cover. When you talk about cities rich in wrestling tradition, you must have this great city, St. Louis, as part of that conversation. Look at this. Bray Wyatt doing some good work here. This guy's just too strong. Camel clutch locked in, wrenching on the neck and lower back. Just a dominating display. Yeah, I think we could see a lot of punishment inflict. Eric Rowan looking to finish this one early. Another great crowd here in St. Louis. The fans here in this great city never disappoint. Are you kidding me? Look! What a display of unmitigated strength. The ring mats in pain after that. Quick pin attempt here. Of all Two. the chilling moves that Bray Wyatt slaughters an opponent with, the worst of them all, which I guess makes sense, is his finishing move. Sister Abigail. Bray just buries his opponent's face right in the mat. Eric Rowan has moved forward.
Bray Wyatt hits the mat hard. Yeah, and I think the entire locker room was excited to see that. Oh, looking to put an end to this one. Claw hold. Kane's going to squeeze the light right out of him. Oh, Kane pulling a page from the book of Baron Von Rasky, or maybe the Von Erichs with that claw hold. Well, Michael, in Bray Wyatt's demented mind, he's comforting his foes before they meet their ultimate doom. The Sister Abigail finishing move is one of the most ghastly to see. And if you're an opponent, one of the worst to have to endure. Cover here. One, two. This could be big. It's an all-out brawl, and that's exactly what you get anytime you take tags out of a tag team match. We're looking at complete domination here. The spinning heel kick, this one in the books. I think you're right, it's over. His shoulders are down. Two. Oh, look at this. The action is fast and furious, and this one is expected. Tornado tag team matches rarely take a slow pace. He's making a statement here with this attack. No breathing room for Kane. Ouch! That'll give you whiplash. Oh, this is not going to be good. Oh, Bray Wyatt. Bray Wyatt. Will this be it? I think he's got it. Two. Bray Wyatt emerges. What a victory! What a match! I can't believe what we saw in that match. One in a million is the only way to describe this match. Oh boy, that was a spectacular performance. Oh, those WWE competitors tore this arena apart. And there's your winners of this Tornado Tag Team match. Now you just gotta take that win and build off it. What a match that was, ladies and gentlemen. Thanks for joining us.